Hello and welcome to Mattel. This is the Disney Princess line right here. Um, of course we've got Frozen. Frozen is still definitely going strong in the 2015 line. Just rounds out some core product as well as infusing some newness into year two from the theatrical release. Uh, so over here, we're really excited about singing Elsa in the spring. Of course, Let It Go is the most popular song from the film. And um, Elsa's wearing her iconic gown, and by pressing the button on her bodice, Let it go. she actually sings the song. It's about a 30 second clip, this is just a preview. She will be a spring and fall TV driver, and joining her in the fall will be singing Anna as well. Anna's wearing her Coronation Day dress, and by pressing the button on her necklace, she sings her song for the first time in forever. Over here, we've got a fashion doll of Anna that's representative of the new Frozen short coming out called Frozen Fever. That will be released on March 13th. We're also excited about a new Olaf item coming into the line. Olaf is a breakout character, and he's also becoming a key character in Disney's marketing plans for Frozen. So there are three main features with this stretch and go Olaf. The first one is that he lifts his head. Hi, I'm Olaf. <laughs> he says sounds and phrases from the movie. And also, <clears throat> these buttons are actually wheels, so he rolls on his stomach Twilight just like in the movie. <laughs> So this item plays on his funny personality and the fact that he is loved by both boys and girls alike. Coming over here, we know through research that girls love the sisterhood and friendship aspects of Frozen. So we created this item specifically with that in mind. This, this item also capitalizes on the popularity of the song, Do You Want to Build a Snowman? So this is our tandem bike accessory. It comes with two Frozen fashion dolls, both Elsa and Anna. And um, these dolls are designed specifically for this accessory because their legs actually pedal with the bicycle as the bicycle moves. It also comes with the Olaf figure, and by pressing the button on the basket, it plays the song, Do You Want to Build a Snowman? This will also be a TV driver in fall. And finally, last but certainly not least, we have a new castle in the fall. This is Elsa's Ice Castle. Uh, this will be a TV driver with a cameo from Action Adventure Elsa. Leverages from the most popular scene in the movie when Elsa sings Let It Go and creates this beautiful ice castle. There are lots of different features that girls will definitely recognize from the film, starting over here. When she transforms the snow into a staircase. We've got a transformation mirror over here with Elsa singing. We have a little Olaf reveal in the window over here. Lots of piece count, the throne, the bed chair all of this is included as well the dance floor Elsa actually makes spin and light up and then of course Elsa makes the castle grow just like in the song so the castle grows to be over three feet tall and when you get to the top you can release the chandelier down the castle does come with this doll stand you see here and there are three places that girls can clip in Elsa so they can really play out the entire scene. As you can see, it's just beautiful all the way around. And girls can play out the final note when she's out on that last balcony, just belting out the end of Let It Go. <laughs> Functional doors as well. Just makes for lots of interactive play. And that is what is new for Frozen in 2015. So uh, we have a new Cinderella live action movie being released on March 13th. Uh, it's directed by Kenneth Branagh and has some stars such as Lily James as Cinderella, Richard Madden as this Prince Charming, Kate Blanchett as the evil stepmother Lady Tremaine, and Helena Bonham Carter as the fairy godmother. So as you can see here, we have four new fashion dolls to really bring those characters to life. Over here, we've got Wedding Day Cinderella. She is sculpted in the likeness of actress Lily James. And as you can see, this dress just celebrates the glorious occasion in this white satin gown with romantic floral patterns that she's sure to be loved by girls, moms, collectors, and fans of the movie, of course. Here we've got our fairy godmother. She's sculpted in the likeness of Helena Bonham Carter. She's wearing her 18th century style gown, beautiful luminescent tones and shimmering star accents on her bodice. Over here we've got Kate Blanchett. She is the evil stepmother, Lady Tremaine, and she is eerily elegant in this green satin gown. And finally, over here, we've got a royal ball blue dress Cinderella. 
Again, sculpted in the likeness of Lily James. She's just enchanting in this iconic dress with the magical butterfly and foil print details. Um, and she also has glass slippers on as well, if you can take a look there. And that is what is new for um, Cinderella live action.